Hello, I'm Mark Mendina, the Warriors beat writer with the Mercury News and the Bay Area News Group. And this is the first episode of the Warriors Looking Forward video series. We'll be having these every week to get you ready for the upcoming games uh, this week. The Warriors have three games this week. First in Chicago on Monday, then they're coming back to Oakland to play a pair of home games at Oracle Arena. First Wednesday, October 31st against the New Orleans Pelicans. And then Friday, November 2nd, against the Minnesota Timberwolves. And I think the, the main storyline is what we've seen the first seven games as the Warriors have gotten to a 6-1 and one start is Steph Curry, Kevin Durant. They're kind of a big deal. They've been really shooting the ball well. They're almost averaging 30 points apiece. You know, Steph Curry had that 51-point night last week against Washington. Kevin Durant had a 41-point night against the Knicks. And Steph Curry thinks, hey, it's possible that they could average 30 points a night. It's certainly within the realm of possibility that they can drop 30 on any given night. But can they do that for 82 games? Steph Curry's pretty confident. Kevin Durant, eh, I think he's being uh, a little bit more reasoned and logical with that. But there has been no signs of those guys stopping anytime soon. Another guy that has been slowing down though, Clay Thompson. He hasn't been shooting the ball well through these first seven games, but this has been a little bit of a pattern when you look at his numbers in the 2015-16 season, 2016-17 season. Those seasons as well, he shot well below his career marks, um, you know, sometimes in the, in the mid 30s and the low 20s. And then at that point, he comes back to being normal with Clay. So maybe we'll see Clay Thompson starting to hit the three ball, starting to make it rain from downtown. Um, the, the Warriors are certainly bracing for that reality. A nice little subplot with the Warriors playing the New Orleans, New Orleans Pelicans on Wednesday is, hey, DeMarcus Cousins is against his former team. But here's the thing, DeMarcus isn't back on the court yet. He's still rehabbing from his left Achilles tendon. But who knows, maybe he gets into a little bit with some former teammates, gets another ejection. That's what happened you know, last Friday against the Knicks, and Steve Kerr was not happy about it whatsoever, so much that DeMarcus felt compelled to apologize to Steve Kerr. But we'll have to see if he's able to, to rein in his behavior when his former team comes to town. But be sure to, to watch all that coverage by going to the Mercury News website. You can subscribe to our Warriors HQ newsletter that hits your inbox every day. And of course, be sure to follow me on Twitter at Mark G underscore Medina. But for now, thanks so much for watching.